Despite education campaigns, the U.S. National Institute of Health says 71 percent of students polled said bullying continues to be a problem. Now a young Arizona boy vacationing here hopes to help victims with a book he's written about his experiences being bullied. KITV4's Jill Kuramoto reports. Levi Falavolita knows what it's like to be bullied. And at first I thought like it was just horsing around and then started getting serious with threats and shoving and then I told my parents and then it also led to like a gun threat. At 12 years old, he's written a book sharing his experience as a fifth grader, being bullied by someone he considered a friend. I just felt really sad and a little angry that someone would do that. I mean, obviously, as a mother, that just breaks your heart. And I, I couldn't believe these kids. Would, they were saying really cruel, hateful things to him, telling him um, his clothes weren't cool, that he, you know, his clothes made him look fat. Levi and his family are here in the islands on a vacation. But he says he knows the issue of bullying is as much of a problem in Hawaii as it is in his home state of Arizona. And his goal is to get his book in schools and libraries across the nation. People can learn from bullying and that bullying would stop and kids would know how to prevent it and be able to stick up for their friends. In Hawaii, the legislature recently passed a law that requires the Department of Education to adopt rules to prohibit school bullying and cyberbullying. But Chantel and Greg Falavolita say it's parents who need to be the first line of defense. Just being aware and then getting involved immediately and getting the school involved is highly recommended um, because the longer parents wait and the longer the children wait to address it or to, or to bring up the issue, then it just escalates. Levi is working on a second book that tells real stories from other bullied victims he's met and also hopes to make a video that will one day help end bullying altogether. Jill Kuramoto, KITV4 News. Levi has been invited to join an anti-bullying task force by Fund for Civility, an organization started by Arizona Congressman Ron Barber after he and Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords were injured in the January 8th shooting in Tucson.